ओम शांति वेलकम टू ट्वेंटी एट ऑफ जनवरीज गॉड लिबर सिंह इधर वी आर सर्विंग ह्यूमैनिटी विद इन अ स्पिरिचुअल वे और इन अ फिजिकल वे फाइनेंशियल वे और इन इधर वे विद सेल्फिश मोटिव्स और वी आर डूइंग इट विदाउट एनी सेल्फिशनेस लेट्स लर्न अबाउट दैट इन डिटेल्स इन दिस ब्यूटिफुल वर्ड दैन सुप्रीम फादर से इज मे यू स्टे बियॉन्ड एनी सेल्फिश मोटिवस एंड रिमेन लविंग इन ऑल योर रिलेशनशिप्स while serving and become a true server in details let's go ahead any service that disturbs you or others is not service but selfishness is very very crucial why would any service disturb me or why would any service disturb somebody else if it is not done in my way if i was not listened to if i was not given a chance to do it If they did not find me worthy of it, that means my you get hurt, then there'll be selfishness. And if any of these weaknesses are there within me, I will try to add on to the fire of not letting that service being done properly. I will create hurdles. I'll make sure that the other person also doesn't get a chance. <coughs> I'll make sure that I say that person is not good enough. Or I'll even go to the extent of saying that I'm better than him. Or I'll try to make sure that if I'm not getting it, he also doesn't get it. Somebody else gets it. <coughs> so this is selfishness. We have to understand if it's there within us, and if we are using this as a manipulative behavior. So it's God's service. It can happen in even corporate sector. It can happen happen even in your household. It can happen even in a spiritual service center. <laughs> so when there is some form of selfishness even in name there is fluctuation fluctuation of our moods when your own selfish motives or the selfish motives of others are not fulfilled there is then some disturbance in service my name wasn't called out i did so much i am better than him if they wanted it to be done better they should have used me or don't they know that uh, that person always spoils the service they shouldn't have chosen him they should have chosen me well it's god who is to getting it done right so then where is i over here therefore stay beyond any selfish motives and remain loving in all your relationships even if somebody says no not you let that person do it getting ego hassles is not being in a loving relationship with god and with your family members or brahmin family or your corporate sector people <laughs> in all your relationships while serving and you will then be called a true server do service with a lot of zeal and enthusiasm but do not let any burden of service make your stage fluctuate pay attention to this any burden of service burden of service comes only when we have selfish motives if we are not having any kind of selfish motives we'll be like okay fine let that person do yes why not go ahead and there'll be no fluctuation in your mood that means you are not selfish that's one of the methods to find out what is our state of mind and how improvement how much of improvement or how better have we become on a daily basis to learn more about it do visit the brahma kumari center om shanti